And on sports, Supaya Gu's coach, um, coach, Joseph Pesiro, says the team star forward Kelechi Yenasho, whose appearance at the 2023 Africa Cup of Nations has been doubtful, will now join the team in Cote d'Ivoire after being certified fit by his club, Leicester City. Yenasho has been nursing a muscle injury, which has kept him from featuring in Leicester's game for a while. But the Portuguese Gaffar wise speaking after the Super Eagles last friendly game with Guinea, said a 27-year-old attacker will be part of Super Eagles campaign in the championship. Our correspondent, Signe Okafor, has more details. It's just a couple of days before the championship starts and football-loving Nigerians are still not enthusiastic about the chances of the fall title for the Super Eagles. Against the backdrop of the 2 old loss to the silly nation of Guinea, Nigerians feel that a team with quality of playing personnel that the Eagles have, they should be winning games without stress. A depletion in the personnel has also not helped a thing that has lost its still at the middle of the pack. We Fred Ndidi and one of its potent attacking force in Victor Boniface, why Hazan Yusuf has been called to replace Ndidi. Terry Murphy has also been named as the replacement for Victor Boniface, pending Cavs approval. Meanwhile, Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwolu will host the Super Eagles on Tuesday night, hours before three-time champion depart for Cote d'Ivoire. Sport Development Minister Senator John Owen Eno will be a co-host of the Glamour event, to which Governor Dury of Bayasa State, Sheyi Makinde of Oyo State, Sheriff Oborewere, Delta State, Abdullahi Sule, Nasara State, and Godwin Obaseki, Edo State, have been invited. Sydney Okafo, TV360, Lagos.